I'm not trying to get a wig headache. Like I'm not trying to get my brain sucked out by a wig. I don't really want the wig hair slicked to my head. There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. Divas. What's up, divas and divas? I thought I would get cute today, or at least try to get cute with you guys today. This video is going to be a synthetic wig unit available at Sam's Beauty. They have like a huge variety. They have an amazing shipping price. Sometimes you can get it for free. They always got good sales going on. This wig that I got is a by Main Concept, okay? Which is one of their newer units, and I'm really excited about it because it reminds me of this other other unit or just this company in general that I used to review wigs on okay so this one is the melon queen and this is a buy um, like I said main concept this is their tiger eye Brazilian frontal lace now first of all it's synthetic but here's the cool thing about this supreme free parting girl you get in 13 by 4 inches of parting Look at this. This is synthetic, okay? But look at all of this amazing parting you're getting in this unit of lace. So you don't have to spend a bundle of coins. You can get you a nice synthetic wig that has all of the options as the human hair ones. It has the combs right here. It has the comb and the adjustable strap in the back in the nape area. And it has a stretch cap. Plus the hair does resemble like human hair. It doesn't look synthetic. It doesn't look plastic. It doesn't look cheap. I think they did a really great job on this unit. Now, as for the color, it's sandy blonde. And this one is the MLF 09 Ripple Wave in 20 inches. So I've already went ahead and did the duties of cutting off the lace. And I did put some of my pressed powder on this bad boy right here, which I normally do. I just put it all throughout the cap. You want to be careful when you're doing that because it will get on the hair, but you can always wipe it away because it's just pressed powder. You know what I mean? It'll just dust right off. Now, like I was saying, it did remind me of this wig brand, which is the A Plus Ozone Synthetic Wigs. If you guys remember them, then you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. They were the ones that first came out with all of this parting, but it reminds me so much of that brand, like the wig construction and the hair texture. But make sure that you also follow Sam's Beauty on Instagram and Facebook, their social media, because they've always got like some really great sales going on, new arrivals, clearances, and giveaways. So you guys, on that note, let's just get into this video real quick. Yeah. 
How she turned out the MLF 09, which is the Ripple Wave 20 inches. She came out cute, like the color is really cute. Cute now, you know what? Synthetic wigs, and you want to slick the baby hairs down on them. You cannot just use regular gel, like even if it says super hold, that stuff has to be super thick. Okay, so I always found like using got to be is the best one for your edges or your baby hairs on a synthetic wig. But if you don't got got to be money, you can always get the dupe version of it, which is the Walmart version. It's the equate. It's the men's equate. It's called equate men's styling and spiking hair gel, super strong holds for multitude of hairstyles and residue free. So it goes on white, just like the actual got to be, and it dries it's clear and it dries and the hold is firm. I've had this for a few months. I've done a video with this applying my wig and it actually does work. So it's probably a few dollars cheaper, but I will say this, if you can't find the got to be in your actual local Walmart, you can definitely check this out and it'll be in the hair styling section. So this is what I used. And um, I don't really use that gel a lot, the gel a lot, not even the got to be that I have because I just not like a huge fan of it. I mean, my go-to madness is the pump it up gold. Like this is my go-to. Okay. Residue free, doesn't leave any mess, um, dries super quick. And yeah, that's, that's my go-to and it holds my wig down for days. And if I start sweating, it's not melting off like the got to be gel. So I rather just not use the gel. I just give me a little bit of the baby hair wispies. I didn't even paste them down to my head. Like I don't really want them slicked down on my head. I don't really want them like that. Like I don't really want the wig hair slicked to my head. So I like this whole concept. Like this is really a great affordable budget friendly wig. For one, the hair texture is really like nice. Okay. It's giving me like that real human hair vibe, okay? So if you're on a budget, or you're not on a budget, but you just like synthetic wigs, you definitely got to pick up this one. I'm not really sure if you're feeling the color, but they do have a variety of colors available at Sam's Beauty. This is a nice unit. It's fun, it's flirty, it's not too much hair. It's a nice length, it's a nice average length. It's easy to put on, it's affordable, girl, and it looks realistic. So you guys, let me know what you think of this synthetic wig. Do you guys like synthetic wigs? Would you get one? And how would you wear it? Do you like main concept? And do you love Sam's Beauty? I love you guys. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, share this video with everybody, your friends and family, and even those that you do not like on all your social media. And I will see you guys on the other side. Uh, uh,